really sorry, but I do just need your cooperation for the next day or so. For this evening, though, just rest and relax. Interviews will be in my office tomorrow. You've all been through quite an ordeal, and the facilities are here for you to enjoy. Great. Come on, let's enjoy ourselves. Thanks. You may as well have a good take. David, is that you? It's time to get out of there, Leon. Get out. Quick. This is the life. Fantastic. Better than a bath any day. <laughs> What's up with you? You look brilliant. Don't look so surprised. I've forgotten how nice you looked under all that dirt and mud. Why, thank you, Harry. I needed that. <laughs> What do you want for your birthday, Harry boy? I was thinking a trip round the bay in my private yacht and then a rave. <laughs> oh, cool. So that's Saturday sort of thing. Uh, party in Harry's room. Do you think David and Sarah will be back with us for that? You can always pop our heads round the door, see how they do it. Yeah, cheer them up a bit. Let's go then. Yeah, let's, let's do, do it. Let's do it. It'll be good Come to on, see them. Come on, let's go. You sure it's here? Yeah, look. On. They're not here. They've gone. Where are they? Uh, Sarah and David have joined Mr. Simmons at the regional hospital. Why didn't you tell us? Oh, because it happened late last night. Does that mean David and Sarah are really ill? They will have to remain in hospital for a few days yet. And then you'll all meet up. And when do we get to make our phone calls? As soon as possible. But I do need to speak with you all. Simon, you're first. Debriefing's in the incident room. Would you like to come with me now? Yes, conduct. I need to get out of here. See what's going on. Yeah. Let's split up. Take the cameras for evidence and check this place out. Yeah. And maybe there's a phone around here somewhere that works. Maybe. Mm -hmm. Right, come on. Yeah, let's go. Come on, stop thinking about last night. What was David trying to say? And why? Was it even David? I can't talk to Sean about this. She seems really worried and upset about something. I don't know whether it's this place or... I think she's worried about what's going to happen between us when we get home. I guess she's trying to end it between us. I don't know if I can handle that. I'm not going to sit around. It's time to get some answers. Interview with Simon Tudor commenced at 10.15 a.m. Bit of a sportsman, so I hear. I like to keep fit. School captain. Head of year. It's very impressive. What was it like out there? Tall hell. I tried to keep everyone's spirits up, but the girls lost it a bit. All that rugged living in the wild really got to them. No offence, but take away a girl's makeup bag and bathroom, and they're lost. <laughs> so you held them all together? I had to. Mr. Simmons went walkabout. You've seen how he is. Somebody had to take the lead. And what brought you out here in the first place? UFOs. A UFO group back in Falkirk. There's been quite a few sightings in the Paramundi area, so we set up an expedition. A 
And you organised the rescue? I radioed in. It's well done, Simon. Your concern for the group has done you great credit. We must make sure you take care of them as well in the future. Smile. This is evidence, you know. Sure, no. Smile for the camera. Why are you being like this? You know, I had a dream last night. It was so real. The phone rang. David was talking to me. Well, maybe it was him. Maybe he tried to call you. I don't know. Maybe I just imagined it. Make sure you get that on tape. Yeah, why all the fences? And security. Why are they trying to keep us in here? It's a detention centre. What did you expect? But why here? I don't know. Leon, relax. We can leave any time we like. I'll prove it. What happened? Must be some kind of electrical force field. if you could phone Scotland. Yes. As I said, we are arranging that. Now, if you'd kindly leave this office... No! Not until I get some answers. Who are you? What do you mean by keeping us here? Look, Lucy. It is Lucy, isn't it? I have told you everything you need to know for now. We are empowered to keep you here for your own safety. You have comfortable quarters, and after you've been questioned, then you're able to leave. Until then, will you kindly obey my instructions and leave this office, as I ask? Or shall I call security and have you evicted? What are we going to do? I don't know. Got it. Get out of here. Leon, no! Can I have a number in Falkirk, please? Falkirk, Scotland? Yes, yeah, Scotland. That will be $12, sir. Where am I going to get $12? Okay. Hello? Morning, ladies. I don't suppose either you lovely ladies could let me say $12? I'm not from around these parts. We guessed that. So, is this the happening place on Saturdays? No. So where do you go then? This is the happening place on Sundays. Sunday? <laughs> I was practically trapped in space by the gates. Like I had some kind of force field. See, why would they need that? To stop people getting out. But why us? Not us. Illegal immigrants. Yeah, but why not just turn it 